What's up everybody, welcome back. Thank you so much for taking the time to hang out. EMT here and in this video, we're showing how to capture dolly shots with the brand new Sandmark motion dolly for smartphones. Let's go. By the way, I want to take a second to shout out Sandmark, not only because they sent us the Motion Dolly for review, but I've been using Sandmark products for a little bit over five years at this point, and they have not disappointed so far. High quality products, high quality accessories, and I just feel like they deserve a shout out for the amazing quality products that they've come out with these past couple of months. This Sandmark Motion Dolly will set you back $89.99 and this thing is rock solid and it has a really nice heft to it. It doesn't feel cheap and this tool has been in my pockets for the last couple of weeks and I've been able to capture some really, really cool shots while on the go. Now the Sandmark Motion Dolly has 300 grams of payload capacity so this gives you the ability to not only mount whichever smartphone you're using to film, but it also allows for you to build your preferred rig. If you wanna add a microphone, if you want to add a light, it includes a ball head that allows you to articulate the included smartphone mount as well as the action camera mount. So pretty much out the box, you're gonna get everything you need to film with the camera that you currently have. If you're filming with your smartphone like I am, out the box, you're not gonna need anything else, straight to the point. Now with the Sandmark Motion Dolly, you can achieve a myriad of different options as far as capturing on the go. My favorite dolly move with the Sandmark Motion Dolly is the actual slider shot, your traditional left to right sliding maneuver. And this type of shot belongs, of course, to the dolly family, so to speak, but the Sandmark Motion Dolly allows you to adjust the angle and you can articulate both wheels so it rotates around a specific subject or to showcase a 360 degree panoramic view of whatever scenery you're looking for. And it's fantastic. The fact that there are no batteries, no cables, just straight to the point shooting is amazing. And I love, this is like my favorite feature about the Motion Dolly. Not only of course that you have four wheels and you can pretty much record any kind of dolly shot, in this case a sliding shot from left to right, but you can articulate the front and the back of the Motion Dolly to create those really cool product B-roll shots. I think it's phenomenal. Another fantastic shot that you can achieve with the Sandmark Motion Dolly is your pan and zoom shot. By simply adjusting the angle of your phone facing your subject, you can slide forward and backwards and create that really cool close-up shot. I was able to take the Sandmark Motion Dolly with me to Disneyland and I legitimately had my phone in my back pocket and my Sandmark Motion Dolly in the other back pocket and some of the accessories in the front pocket. So I was packing the whole rig in my pockets without anything else and it was fantastic because the moment that we sat down on a table to grab a drink or to eat some food, I was able to capture B-roll on the fly and professional looking video, not only handheld video, which looks great, but there's something about the sliding maneuvers and the zooming in, the pan and zoom effect shots that give your footage a little bit more legitimacy. It makes it look a little bit more professional and it's so easy and so effortless. You can switch it up for portrait as well and create TikToks and Instagram videos with the slider just by simply mounting the back of the phone grip to the tilting head, which is great because one device, the motion dolly from Sandmark allows you to capture not only regular landscape videos, but also portrait videos for a variety of different platforms. And my third favorite shot that I was able to capture with the Sandmark Motion Dolly is the Zolly or the Dolly zoom effect, that push pull effect that your background zooms out as you're getting closer to your subject or zooming in as you're pulling away from your subject. And it creates that Hitchcock like effect, that vertigo effect. And I was able to achieve this using filmic Pro, which you can download either on the App Store or the Google Play Store, and it allows you to automatically set zoom in key points, your start point and end point. All you gotta do is tap on your zoom slider and it'll automatically zoom, and all you gotta do is pull away 
or zoom out and push forward. And because you're on wheels, everything looks very smooth, very fluid. Combined, of course, with the optical image stabilization of your smartphone, it creates a fantastic looking shot with very, very minimal effort. So in my personal opinion, this Sandmark Motion Dolly is a must have tool for any kind of smartphone visual storyteller. Whether you're doing product videography or you simply wanna capture sliding shots, pan zoom shots or dolly zoom shots, I was genuinely surprised by the quality of this product. I saw it on their website when Sandmark announced it and it looked cool, but I didn't see myself using it until I started using it and then everything clicks. And now this thing is perpetually in my arsenal. It's in my desk here. I have it all the time. Whenever I want to watch a movie, a video, or even FaceTime, I actually have it there and I can move it around. So not only for capturing content, but also for daily use is a fantastic device. So hopefully these three tips for how to capture dolly zooms with the Sandmark Motion Dolly are helpful. And if you end up picking one up, don't forget to use promo code EMT Sandmark so you can save some money at checkout but I wanna know what you think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them down there so we can continue to create relevant content for you. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. All the links to all the gear I use are down in the description, including the Sandmark Motion Dolly. And as always, thank you so much for sharing your time with me. I'll catch you on the next one.